Hi, I'm Lon Lam, and today I'm going to teach you how to make fresh pasta without a pasta maker. First, you'll need a food processor. Now add two cups of flour, two tablespoons of olive oil, and this olive oil is our trick for keeping the dough malleable and easy to roll out by hand. Now add two large eggs and six egg yolks and process for about 45 seconds. The extra egg yolks contain protein, which doesn't impact the structure of the dough until it's cooked. We get a pasta with the right amount of chew, but our raw dough remains easy to work with. Okay, it's been about 45 seconds. The dough should be soft and barely tacky to the touch. I'm not quite there yet. I'm gonna add a little more flour, one tablespoon at a time, until I get that tacky texture. Turn out the dough onto a dry surface and knead until smooth. That's gonna take one to two minutes. Then shape it into a six inch cylinder and wrap that cylinder in plastic wrap. Now let it rest for four hours. This long rest allows the gluten to relax. It'll be much easier to roll out and your arms are gonna thank you for it. After four hours, cut the dough into six equal pieces. Make sure to keep the dough covered when you're not working with it. Press the dough into a three inch square with your fingers then begin to roll it out with your rolling pin. We're looking for a six inch square here. That's close enough. Now dust both sides lightly with flour. We actually want this dough to cling to the counter just a little bit so it doesn't spring back. So I'm gonna start with my rolling pin in the middle of the square and I'm gonna roll away from myself and then I'm gonna pick the pin back up, center it, and roll back towards myself until the rectangle is about 12 inches long. Now we want to continue to roll until it's about 20 inches long. At this stage, you want to lift the dough frequently to make sure it's not sticking to the counter. And if it does, just dust with a tiny bit more flour and continue. Once you're done rolling, the dough should be slightly transparent and you should be able to see your fingers through the sheet. Let this sheet sit on a dish towel uncovered and roll out the remaining dough. After about 15 minutes, the edges of that first sheet should have firmed up a little bit. Working with one sheet at a time, fold at two inch intervals, and then slice. You're aiming for noodles that are 3 16 of an inch here, but who's counting? Now use your fingers to loosen them up a bit. Finally, boil them in a pot of salted water. They'll only take about three minutes. And enjoy! You just made handmade fresh pasta and you didn't have to go out and buy a machine. Thanks for watching. Tell us what you thought of this how-to in the comments and hit that subscribe button below.